फ्रेंड्स वुड एंड इट बी ग्रेट इफ यू कुड कनेक्ट अवर ए आई चैट बॉट लाइक चैट जी पी टी क्लॉड टू अवर टैली प्राइम एंड आस्क सम क्वेश्चन सो इट्स पॉसिबल एम सी पी और मॉडल कंटेक्स प्रोटोकॉल इज अ कैपेबिलिटी टू डू दिस सो इन द फर्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ द वीडियो आई विल डेमोस्ट्रेट इट दिस ऑन क्लॉड ए आई सो आई विल आस्क फ्यू क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम ए आई चैट बॉट एंड इट विल सर्च फॉर आंसर इन टैली डेटा एंड वी विल प्रिपेयर सम डैशबोर्ड बेस्ड ऑन इट and in the second part of the video i will walk you through the installation i have open one of the company in tally techno traders limited it's a, just a fake or demo company and this is a very old data of financial year 2021 and i want to ask my ai questions on this tally data and come up with some analysis so these are two tasks okay so let's start so i will click and open cloud ai okay so this is also one of the popular ai just like chat gpt and gemini cloud is also leading one so and this is a desktop version of cloud and i am using a paid version of this cloud okay pro version and i have set up my mcp server already so installation i have demonstrated afterwards okay so if i click here so i would i can see so i am connected to tally prime so my ai has access to my tally prime data okay so if i ask any question here and include some reference of tally prime it would basically search for the data in tally prime and attempt to answers so let's say um, let's lay man question that what is the balance of wipro okay so let's say i have one of the customer called wipro okay so what is the balance of wipro for financial year 2021 okay now i am not sure whether really any ledger by name wipro exist or it is wipro limited or wipro software so it is up to the ai to search for the accurate ledger and get me the balance for this financial year end okay so ai would do it let's see from tally prime so we need to give hint otherwise it would try to search this uh, on internet okay so this would give it some hint let's wait okay so it's trying to connect to my tally okay so it didn't find any ledger by name wipro so it is trying to check ledgers okay okay it ledger is by name wipro technology you can see and it says the finance balance of wipro as on 31st march 2021 is 94171 debit balance let's check so if i go to balance sheet current assets sundry debtors let me expand this wipro okay so there was no ledger by name simple wipro it was wipro technology but ai could automatically fetch the ledger list and corrected this uh, prompt okay it is 94171 okay so this way ai can automatically talk to your tally locally running tally and try to uh, fetch answers let's go forward okay let's ask one more question to ai okay so i will start a new chat i'll say let's say analyze my standing for customers for fy 2020 21 from tally prime you need to include some hint let's see what it fetches so it will first try to fetch bill out standing report from tally and then it would try to churn some data and show some dashboard of this analysis so let's wait for this to complete so generally it might develop some report sort of
you can see start so infosys represents 58% of your total outstanding it is showing composition tata consultancy 34 and based on the outstanding days it is let's ask one more question okay so present this data in the form of dashboard or of dashboard okay let's see what it can do the form of dashboard so it knows that previous uh, whatever data it got let's see it would try to make or prepare a small dashboard using an using html okay let's see what we get now this is a bit heavy for uh, any of the ai because it is actually coding or generating an, a web page small web page to be displayed here let's see what it comes out so if you are on free plan maybe you would be exhausted out of the limit by this time okay since we are on the paid plan we could reach here okay. so it is generating a very long scripting to present it graphically let's see what we get i want i don't understand what this code is okay okay you can see some nice dashboard okay a pie chart something out timeline wise outstanding let me see if i can squeeze and make it bigger okay <laughs> even okay so it's a very beautiful and nice dashboard it was able to prepare generally you will require uh, power bi or in excel maybe you can prepare like this but it would require long amount of time and with this ai directly connecting with your tally just in few minutes it is doing all this thing let me walk you through the installation of tally mcp server so first thing you need to go to the home page of this project open source project tally mcp server don't worry i have shared linked in the youtube video description okay now there are two requisites for this you must have tally prime and that to registered license not an educational one and node.js okay so tally already i am on gold license and second one is node.js it should be already installed if you don't have you can click here and go to this node.js website and get node and install it okay now next thing you need to ensure that tally should be running as uh, xml server on port 9000 so you can go to like f1 settings connectivity So set it to server or both and port should be 9000. Okay. Now let's start. Okay. Now we will be, be downloading this utility. Sorry, tally MCP server. So let me click here and download it. So let me save it in my folder. So I will save it on D drive software. let me extract it so extract all to let's say i will make this folder name as tally mcp server okay let's wait for the extraction okay so let's go okay so you are here on this okay now let me launch cloud desktop okay so cloud desktop you can google search cloud ai desktop okay and you can install the desktop version of cloud ai like i have already installed my desktop version of cloud ai so let me open this okay 
now let's go to search and tools okay and let's click manage connector and before that you should be on a pro license or team license if you are on free license maybe uh, you would run out of the limits when you are doing this okay so i am on pro plan okay so i'll click tools manage connectors go to developer edit config okay and this cloud desktop config.json so i'll right click and edit this via normal notepad or you can do notepad plus plus whichever you want okay now this entire text you have to replace with so if you go here okay okay so let me copy this json and delete and replace okay now one thing you need to do you need to point to whichever folder where you have downloaded this like in my case i downloaded it to software tally mcp server okay so d drive software tally mcp server and single slash should be replaced with double slash okay and this thing already so my basically mcp server is uh, inside this dist folder distribution folder which okay let us save this save and exit it okay now if i again close and open this exit and again let me relaunch this cloud ai now i should get this tally prime uh, mcp server running okay now if we click here okay you can see this tally prime mcp server running and if you click on this you can see multiple tools or capabilities or we can say reports which it can connect to like it can list masters trial balance can fetch ledger balance stock atom balance okay so these are the tools so as of the release date these were the tools which i had added support maybe in future you will find many more reports here if you like this video do not hesitate to press like button share this video with your friends and colleagues and subscribe to the youtube channel for more such videos